Hey guys, this is Mike with Invite Solutions. Just kind of show you an update of the office here, so let's go down there. So this is the waiting room. Um, got a few chairs here. Got a closet here. Um, there's another identical closet there in, in a back room, and I'm thinking one of these closets I'm going to put a little locking doorknob here and uh, only allow uh, certain people to be able to get in there, like when they're doing PC builds or something, and then just always keep it stocked up with parts we always have on hand. So like an inventory kind of closet. Um, you have a little desk there, uh, background music playing. We have the uh, printer and the wireless router here. Couple other things, uh, some common parts, some memory chips and stuff. Those mean they're used memory chips, so I'm not worried about them being out. Um, we got the uh, laptop disassembly station here. We got some uh, reflow station there as well. This is actually right over here on the window cell. This is for charging up devices after they've been repaired, so like a screen replacement or an iPod or an iPad or something. We charge them up for the customer when they're done. Um, I actually got these shelves mounted last night. I, I like the way it turned out. I like them side by side. I wasn't sure where to put them. Um, so I got the uh, different tools and stuff and that's really convenient when someone's working on a computer. They've got the, uh, the thumb drives here. This table I'm really excited about. It turned out really well. I, I made it myself. I got some wood down from Home Depot, sanded it, stained it, and it turned out really well. As you can see, I've got the uh, monitors mounted there. Um, KVM here on the right. This is uh, the pending work station, and then machines that have been completed will also be set on here. So a clear room off of the bench there. This little hallway right here. Um, the landlord has put in this door to connect to the other space. It has a deadbolt lock on it, only they have the key the landlord um, so they actually should be coming through the front door at all times so I'm actually gonna block this off with something maybe like a gorilla racker right now it's wasted space so I'm probably gonna do something with it then in here we've got a back room whole bunch of junk right now um, probably gonna if, if we get really busy and I get quite a few more techs I'll put stuff in, in the back room here um, maybe make it an office. This is the identical closet with the one in the front. Right now I've just got tons of different cables, PC parts, extra stuff. This is the IT room. Got all the different uh, spaghetti wiring crap in here. Um, I don't want to mess with things. This is actually connects from the building up, uh, upstairs as well. So. And some of their stuff can, some of their wires come down into the switch, which I thought was really weird, but um, I didn't really want to mess with anything. Um, I did organize it a little bit, as you can see, but I didn't want to do too much because then we'll get in trouble. Um, I'll probably do something eventually with it. But yeah, down here we got our uh, security camera DVR that is uh, connects uh, the waiting room uh, camera, and I'm going to put another camera in the uh, uh, tech repair room there in the back. Um, the waiting room uh, actually detects movement, and when there's movement, it'll uh, it'll retain the video. So I think that's really cool. Um, it's it's actually the cameras are pretty cheap. They're like sixty bucks on Amazon, and then I got this just little junky laptop, and I took the screen off and made that to the uh, the DVR where I record stuff too. That is really about it. Um, nice little space. I'm really excited. I've got some. Quite a few good ideas. As you can see, here's the bathroom there. I got a picture up there. Um, so yeah, that, that's about it.